Hey guys, the objective of this video is to find the amount of spacing we need in our bottom reinforcing for slab one. And then we're gonna to have to also look at something called the minimum spacing requirements, which is from clause 9.4.1b. So just to remind you of where we're at, we've so far seen that the amount of steel we need, the area of steel we need is 497 millimeters squared per meter. Okay, so we found that, and we also checked that against the minimum steel requirements in the previous video. So now we're up to finding the spacing. So let's just quickly look how the spacing is gonna work. So, so what we have, if I give you a little drawing of our slab, is we're gonna have bars like this. And we're gonna look at one meter of slab. Now in this one meter, this needs to be 497 millimeters squared of steel. That's how much steel we need in this one meter. So we're also using N12 bars. That's what we said at the start, that these um, reinforcing bars are N12. So now we need to work out the amount of spacing between each bar. Okay, so that's how you do it for slabs. Uh, if you'd be pretty stupid, like you could give the number of bars if you, if you really wanted to, but it's much cleaner just to give the amount of spacing between each bar. So, the way we do that is we have the spacing is simply equal to the area of a single N12 12 bar. So, pi by 6 squared, pi r squared, divided by the total area per meter, 497, and then we just multiply that by a meter length, all right? So that little formula there will work out the spacing for us. So if we were to work this out, pi by six squared is roughly 113 on 497 by 1000. And this would give us a value of around 227. Now, whenever you give spacing, you don't wanna give it to stupid values like this. You wanna give it a nice rounded value because what's actually gonna happen is you're gonna put this on a drawing and a builder's gonna come and he's not gonna measure it to 227 millimeters. You wanna give a nice value. So to be a little bit conservative, we're gonna give it as 230 millimeters. That's a lot nicer, okay? So we now know that the spacing in our slab between each N12 bar is at 230 millimeters.